morning guys welcome to another video from East Midland Field Sports so today is the first day of our ferreting season we do like to wait until we get a bit of good weather it's not too warm and today for me the conditions are perfect it's what I like ferreting in it's bright and sunny and we've got the very first frost of the year or not of the year of winter shall we say the temperatures drop right down to about one degree whereas what a couple of weeks ago when I was out rough shooting with a dog it was about 15 16 degrees so it was still quite warm but we're going to do something different today we normally start on easy warrens when we first um, kick off the season it just breaks the ferret back into it after having all the summer time off but instead of netting these little fence line warrens we're actually going to bolt and shoot them today all going to give it a go anyway i've got three of the no two hob ferrets with me today sorry i've got my 20 bore and i've got simon my 12 bore um aya side by side so i'm going to go to the field wait for simon to finish the dogging in on the pheasant shoot and we can see if we can bolt some bunnies so i'm at the grounds now i'm just having a quick look around some of these warrens I'm just waiting for Simon. So these are the ones we're doing this morning. It's got some sheep in there, but there shouldn't be too much of an issue. But this is what we like about the early season ones, just come to nice, easy warrens. There's one over there. It shouldn't take too long this morning. I think that one is actually part of that one. But I say, it's a nice morning. The rabbit just gone down in here. So at least there's one in there. Cool, so what I'd like to do is say, just come and have a look at the warrens and just think where we can stand. Because Simon's left-handed and I'm right-handed. So sometimes it actually benefits us because obviously he stands the left of me and I stand to the right of him. I speak of the devil, there he is now, just coming up the road. Right then, ferrets are all collared up. I've got the guns. Let's see what we can bolt out. So then, I thought I'd give you guys a bit of an update. Simon's gone to go and get a spade, because I forgot to bring one this morning. Because on the last warren, and the hob ferret is marking between one and three on the locator, just on the, in the fence line. We popped him in. Ah, he's just come up. And Simon's gone as well. At least he's still about. But what he done, we put him in, he bolted a rabbit, I shot that, which is brilliant. It's been quiet for about 15 minutes. So he's obviously killed in there or gotten in the stop end. So I might as well wait for Simon to come back. And if he goes back to it, we'll try and dig to it, because it's not very deep. But the second warren we done, it was very active. Bolted six rabbits out there and we shot three. I didn't pick any upon the shot cam. Simon shot first one, shared the second one. And I shot the third one. We did have a fourth one that Simon shot and then I shot at. Um, and it just folded and went down what we call the first warren. And we can't risk doing it. It it would be dead, but I say we can't retrieve it. And we can't put the ferret down there because we'll end up digging anyway. But um, I hope the shot cam picked at the rabbits I've got. So I'm just going to hang on here for Simon. See if we can dig to this ferret or if it bolts the rabbit out. And we might have a look on that far hedge, see if we can do a little bit on there. Well, that was a uh interesting mornings ferreting I apologize if I didn't capture a lot of footage because on the uh, first warren we done 
most of the rabbits were coming out to Simon and he'd done some brilliant shots on them to be honest I shot a few um, I did miss a couple but we ended up with six rabbits in total and we bolted nine one of them was hit very hard folded up and went down a hole on the next warren and we didn't want to risk it so we left that one there was the one I missed and there was another one I didn't want to take a shot it was going up on top of a brow of a hill um, safety is always first so I let that one go so they're the three that we missed and then we ended up um, going to a friend's field shelter and just bolting some rabbits out for him and that was nice we had two come out and shot both of them um, we've only been out for a couple of hours but like I said it's uh, been a fun way to start the Ferriton season anyway but like normal guys give me a like and subscribe and I'll try and put a rabbit cookery video up out of one of the rabbits. See you soon.